a lot of people, including myself, have had the idea, or at least toyed sort of playfully with the idea, that the phenomenal universe is something that we've, that each of us has conjured into existence as a distraction from looking inside of ourselves. Because for whatever reason, looking inside is something we simply find too horrifying. Uh, that the universe is just some sort of gigantic distraction that we've willed into being um, and keep in being through great effort um, because there's something within us that we simply don't want to face uh, be it just the eternity in existence dealing with our own boredom and futility um, or um, the fact that, for whatever reason, that reality itself is absolutely horrid. Uh, and that the purpose, we've, we've sort of construed this reality, brought it into existence, simply as a means to distract ourselves from that. Um, again, it's Zopfi's distraction, but sort of on steroids. We don't n just need to distract ourselves when we're in the physical plane of existence, but we need to distract ourselves absolutely existentially we need to simply distract ourselves from our own existence that's <laughs> that's I think the wellspring of existential panic is this idea that you know the universe isn't real you know the if you've ever had a severe panic attack you feel like you're about to evaporate or uh, the universe is about to dissolve before your eyes um, and uh, it basically has a, the the whole feeling of a serious existential panic attack is annihilation. Um, why would we fear reality itself? Why would um, the fundamental nature of the universe, of the cosmology, of absolutely everything physical and non-physical, terrify us? Is it fundamentally terrifying? Presumably not, because there are people who seem to face it and are not terrified by it. There are people who face it and do seem to be terrified by it. What makes the difference? 